If you've been waiting for the market to crash, now might be your time to act. There are areas in San Diego where prices are actually down this year, and even compared to last year, they're down. So I'm gonna go over five areas in San Diego in this video where you might be able to get a great deal on a home. Let's get started. Hi, my name's Allison Can. I am a real estate agent here in San Diego, and I am a bit of a data nerd. So I have spent some time in the past week digging through all of the data on the different zip codes in San Diego and have found five neighborhoods where prices have actually dropped fairly significantly since the highs earlier this year. And in fact, are also lower than the prices this time last year. So if you've ever wanted to be able to turn back real estate time and buy last year, this could be your chance. The first neighborhood we're gonna talk about is Rancho Penasquitos. Rancho Penasquitos is a fantastic neighborhood. It is in North County, San Diego, and it is located near Carmel Valley. So prices here have been skyrocketing because those people who couldn't afford Carmel Valley went to Rancho Penasquitos because it's right next door and still has great schools. This year, Prices in Rancho Penasquitos are down 1.4% compared to last year, this time. But within the year, since the high in April, we have seen prices drop 22%. Prices in Rancho Penasquitos are at the median price is about 1.1 million right now, but it did reach a high earlier this year of over 1.4 million. So it's been quite a reduction. If you are looking for a deal in a really great school district with newer houses and some amazing views from their park, this might be a great place to look. The next area is 92105, which is City Heights. This area has seen a very big rise in recent years, but is currently down 3.9% compared to this time last year, and is down 27% from the high this year in June. That high was about $705,000, and now we're looking at about 552. City Heights is a great area because it is super centrally located. Prices are still relatively low and it's totally up and coming. There's some great restaurants over there and you're really, really close to North Park. Our third area is 92111. Prices in 92111, which is Linda Vista and Kearney Mesa, have dropped 33% from the high this year in June. And they're down about 2% since this time last year. So the current median price is around $770,000, but it had topped out at $900,000. So if you're looking for a great area to get potentially like a flip or a rental home for USD students, that could be a really great area for you. I am standing in the Grant Hill Community Park here in Grant Hill. This park has arguably some of the best views in all of San Diego. That's the Coronado Bay Bridge right there. It's just an amazing view. A lot of the people who work here work at the port and it has unfortunately taken probably the biggest tumble in San Diego in prices this year. So prices year over year are down 13%. And just since the high in April, prices are down 37%. The current median price is $535,000 and the high was $850,000. Now the caveat to that is that it's kind of a small area. There aren't a ton of transactions being done here. So, you know, if one month there were a bunch of condos and then the next month there were a couple of fourplexes or like nicer houses, then that could definitely skew things and make them go, you know, make the prices swing a little more wildly. Regardless, even with that taken into consideration, there are probably some really good deals to be had here. Um, given the views here and the architecture, the houses here just need some love and they are, so many of them are adorable. So if you really, really, really want a deal, this could be the best place to get it. And finally, number five is our area with the biggest drop inside this year is Sarah Mesa, 92123. This area has gone down 42% since the high this year in April. That was when prices topped a million dollars 
and they're now at 720 so it's a really big difference now there are fewer sales in this area so again this could be impacted by that um, it just depends on what sold each month so there could be a big difference because it is only down just over two percent since this time last year but again this is a fantastic area that's super central good prices great houses could be a really good place to get your first house Please don't forget to like this video and hit the subscribe button so you can be alerted whenever I have new videos out. Please comment, let me know if you liked anything specific about this video or if there's anything I can improve or any other topics you'd like me to cover. And check out my next video.